Today I am making cube steak and gravy with biscuits. These are just cube steaks I got from the meat market. I'm just going to brown them up. I seasoned them and I used uh, salt, pepper, garlic, onion, uh, some Worcestershire and I'm just going to brown these and then I'm going to uh, lower the heat and cover it and add some gravy and let them simmer. Turn this down just a little. And then my gravy, I got these convenience gravies right here. This one is only 12 ounces. This one makes two cups. I'm pretty sure I'm going to use this. I haven't tried this yet. $3.59 for gravy. Can you believe it? It better be good. So what I do is I put the gravy in after that's almost, well, it'll be fully cooked, but then I need to um, put the gravy in and just simmer it on low till those are real tender. And it's real good over mashed potatoes. So I'm going to make, I don't have time for homemade potatoes today because I just didn't realize it was this late. Um, so I'm going to use these. I'm not a fan of these kind of potatoes, uh, instant potatoes is what I mean. But they have a lot of new flavors out. This one I actually liked. This one's made with chicken broth. I've had it before. It's really good. So I'm not, I'm not mad about it. And then I'm going to make these, well, these are in the oven right now. These Meyer biscuit mix, jalapeno and cheddar, which I got on a clearance for $1.39, like two weeks ago. And I added, um, what does it say? It needs cheese, milk, and butter. So you have to make a mess if you want these biscuits. I had to get out a bowl, um, grate some cheese, melt some butter, blah, blah, blah. Those are in the oven. And that's it. I will come back and show you what my plate looks like. His plate looks like whatever. No vegetables today. I just don't feel like it. Loki is anxious to go out, so I'll be back. Something may have went wrong with my budget biscuits. It said to put the oven on 450, which is a bit much, but I followed the instructions. I just hope the inside isn't like, I mean, they're drop biscuits, right? So what are you gonna do? Oh yeah, they're fluffy on the inside. That's all that matters. And it's crispy on the outside. It'll hold up to the gravy. I'm going to take a little bite. Hmm. Okay. Yep, they're good. This is going to work. Just a hint of jalapeno in there. And the cheddar. It's good. So these are just simmering in the gravy, maybe um, 20, 30 minutes, maybe longer. Just make sure that you don't use very high heat because your gravy will disappear and evaporate. So I just keep checking on it, stirring it around. I sure don't want my gravy to disappear because I'm going to need it for them tough ass biscuits. So here is my plate, and the gravy actually was pretty rich and really good. I was kind of worried how my man would like the biscuits, but he started eating those as soon as he walked in the door. So that turned out okay. I already knew he'd like the Salisbury steak the way I make it, and he doesn't really mind instant potatoes every now and then. So we sat down and ate, and not my best meal. But it was okay for a quick one, and the important thing is that we ate today, and we ate together. So for that, 
I can be grateful. And my dog's barking. Then it's time to do dishes. Wash the-